My name is Paul Tran. I'm 22 years old. I've been doing drag for two years now. I go perform under the stage name Kamora Hall. My freshman year of college, I saw my first drag show and I was really inspired by them because I just saw these three beautiful entertainers being proud of who they are and I knew that this was something that I wanted to do one day. And luckily, my junior year of college, they allowed students to perform in the show and so I took that as an opportunity to finally start and then since then, I've just been doing it ever since. Okay, so here we go. Now we have, the board is going to decide who's not getting a lot of votes, so. Loyola University Chicago holds an annual drag show that promises a good time for all students. I feel like a lot of people, gay or straight, they kind of see drag queens as like, almost like clowns or a joke, but really it's a serious thing and when I get in drag, I feel really empowered by it and I'm just kind of self, showing self-expression and diversity and showing that it's okay to be who you are. And <laughs> Um, for me, drag is very much playing with gender roles or like gender fucking like and exploring femininity, exploring like a different gender than what you yourself might identify as. I think it's fair for for females as well who want to explore like masculinity and explore that role. So yeah, I think kings are great. I think they're they can be really funny and they can perform just as well as queens can. Drag queens have to be entertaining. They're, nobody's gonna like them. I don't know. So I think I think the persona and I think the look are important because it doesn't matter what your aesthetic is but that you're polished in your aesthetic is what's important. No, I mean I think I think it's always an evolution like any type of like expression or like especially artistic expression I think you evolve you know not only your character but you as a person. Drag is an art form that these performers take seriously. It is meant to empower people inside and out of the queer community as well as inspire them to be who they want to be. But I know that in Chicago, it's, it's really like a sorority. We all really help and support each other. And that's what drag is. I mean, you see some drag reality TV shows now and all they really showcase is the kind of cattiness and the drama of it. But really, it's all about the sisterhood. I know, I always like, like the phrase that doing drag is just being a man in a dress. I guess drag is, drag is about performativity in, in an entertainment sense. And then being someone that you want to be or portraying a, someone else that you never felt like you could before, but allowing yourself the freedom to do so. It's like a roller coaster, it's crazy fun, but you'll have hard times sometimes where you get back up and it's all that matters. <laughs> so